Beatification from Latin beatus, blessed, and facere, to make, is a recognition accorded by the Catholic Church of a dead person's entrance into heaven and capacity to intercede on behalf of individuals who pray in his or her name. Topic: History. Local bishops had the power of beatifying until 1634, when Pope Urban VIII, in the Apostolic Constitution Coelestis Jerusalem of 6 July, reserved the power of beatifying to the Holy See. Since the reforms of 1983, one miracle must be believed to have taken place through the intercession of the person to be beatified, though the medical investigations of the Church are conducted privately and are therefore subject to speculation about their methods. The requirement of a miracle for beatification is waived in the case of someone who died as a martyr, the feast day for a blessed person is not universal, but is celebrated only in regions where the person receives particular veneration. For instance, St. Kateri Tekawitha was especially honored in the United States and Canada during her time as blessed. The person may also be honored in a particular religious order, diocese, or organization, such as John Dunn Scotus among the Franciscans, the Archdiocese of Cologne and other places. Similarly, veneration of Blessed Chiara Badano is particular to the Focolari movement. Her case also demonstrates that, contrary to popular opinion, beatification may take place within a relatively short time after a person's death of an individual for Badano, 20 years. <laughs> Practices under the popes Pope John Paul II, the 18th of May 1920 to the 2nd of April 2005, markedly changed previous Catholic practice of beatification. By October 2004, he had beatified 1340 people, more than the sum of all of his predecessors since Pope Sixtus V, 1585 to 1590, who established a beatification procedure similar to that used today. John Paul II's successor, Pope Benedict XVI, removed the custom of holding beatification rites in the Vatican with the Pope presiding, they now can be held where the subject lived with the Cardinal Prefect of the Congregation for the Causes of Saints designated to preside over the ceremony as Papal Delegate. The Pope himself still can preside, as happened on 19 September 2010, when Benedict XVI beatified John Henry Newman in Cofton Park, Birmingham, on the last day of his visit to the United Kingdom. Benedict XVI also personally celebrated the Beatification Mass for his predecessor, John Paul II, at St. Peter's Basilica, on the second Sunday of Easter, or Divine Mercy Sunday, on 1 May 2011, an event that drew more than one million people. <laughs> Cultus confirmation Cultus confirmation is a somewhat different procedure, wherein the Church recognizes a local cult of a person, asserting that veneration of that person is acceptable. Such a confirmation is more an official sanctioning of folk Catholicism than an active step in a canonization procedure, but the object of the cult may equally be addressed as, "...blessed". See also Chronological list of saints and blesseds List of beatified people List of people beatified by Pope John Paul II List of saints List of servants of God Lists of venerable people References Citations Sources Bakari, Camillo. 1907. Beatification and Canonization. Catholic Encyclopedia. Robert Appleton Company. Volume 2 via New Advent, NewAdvent.org. Bakari, Camillo. 1913. Beatification and Canonization. In Herbermann, Charles. Catholic Encyclopedia. New York, Robert Appleton Company. De Meester, A., J. C. D., Juris Canonici et Juris Canonico Civilis Compendium Nova Editio, Tomus Tertius, Pars Secunda, Brugis, Desclay de Brouwer et S.I.I., 1928. Saunders, Rev. William. 2003. The Process of Becoming a Saint. Reprinted from Arlington Catholic Herald. Via Catholic Education Resource Center, CatholicEducation.org. Vatican website, with new procedures. 
Topic: External links. List of all blessed in the Catholic Church by gcatholic.org.